In this series, I'm going to reproduce my minimalistic VS Code setup step by step. As you can see, most of the UI elements are hidden, because I prefer to use keyboard shortcuts for almost everything. And before we start, I will mention that at the time of the recording of this video, I use latest VS Code version, which is 1.96. Alright, so this is how VS Code looks like without applying any configurations. We are going to add settings directly inside VS Code configuration file, which can be opened by using command palette. We can open this command palette by pressing command shift P on Mac OS or Ctrl Shift P on Windows. And here we'll choose open user settings JSON option. This is the configuration file where we're going to add all our settings. So the first option that I'm going to add in here will be responsible for setting up color theme. I will use Aura Dracula Spirit Soft theme. And firstly, we have to install the extension of this theme. So let's switch over to the extensions panel. We can open up extensions panel by running view show extensions command inside command palette. And here I will look for the theme called Aura Dracula Spirit. And let's go ahead and install this theme. I will select the second variant of this theme called Soft. And right away we're seeing how VS Code look is changed. And now I will mainly hide all the UI elements. So let's start from this panel called Activity Bar. And by the way, anytime we do any kind of modifications to the file with settings, we have to save it first in order for those changes to take effect. After I press save, we can see that activity bar disappeared. Next one, I'm going to hide this panel with tabs. Let's save configuration file once again, and tabs disappeared as well. Once again, I use keyboard shortcuts to navigate throughout the project, so I don't use that tab bar. The next setting status bar visible allows us to hide the following status line at the bottom of the editor. The Startup Editor allows us to configure what will be displayed once we're gonna open up VS Code. I prefer to not show anything, so instead we're only going to see VS Code logo, which looks like this, when there will be no files opened. Also this screen by default shows some keyboard shortcuts, I prefer to hide those shortcuts, so I'm using tips.enabled option set to false. And after saving the changes, those shortcuts will disappear. There is also this minified view of the code. I prefer to hide it. So let's add the option minimap.enabled with the value of false. Sometimes at the top of the open file we might see some breadcrumbs. I don't use those, so let's hide it by setting up breadcrumbs.enabled option set to false as well. And eventually we end up with such view of VS Code, which is already pretty minimalistic. In the next lesson we'll continue configuring VS Code. And link to the source code with this configuration file will be in the video description.